Hello my beautiful new mommies, so excited uh, to have you here and uh, my channel is all about uh, helping moms find their village for better balance and support and really this came about from my first year experience of becoming a new mom of baby and going from being a career woman to staying at home. Um, I did not have a map, I also did not have any family in town, and so I quickly realized that I needed help and I, I wanted a village that I was going to need to go out and create one. And so, um, you know, I'll be going into different areas of my story, but today I want to focus on the three phases that I went through in the first year, and this is looking back, um, in the first year of mommyhood. And really it's just for some fun ideas and inspiration. So, um, the first one is months one through three. And in this phase, my main focus was routines and surviving. Um, so, so really just trying to figure out what the new baby's routine was gonna be and then me surviving the new baby's routine. Um, so this was a lot of fun, uh, a lot of learning, um, not a lot of sleep. My body was still healing and so just still trying to be patient with myself and take things slow and baby was priority. So for the second phase, this is months three through six, the, my main focus was fitness and connecting with others. So, you know, my body did take a while to heal um, and I started working out at home first because I didn't feel like I was ready to go back to a gym. Some some moms are able to go back to a gym. That's fantastic. Um, I When I was attending some of the gyms in months, oh gosh, even five, I think, at uh, the fifth month, um, I saw some moms that looked like they had four week old babies and that that's amazing. I wish my body bounced back like that. But it did not. So um but in months three, in the month the third month, I was ready to join a gym and start to get a little bit more uh invest a little bit more just in my body and, and just being active as well. Even if it was just to walk around the neighborhood, that was really important for me. And then, so it was fitness and connecting with others. So connecting with others, uh, the one of the ways that I did this when I was homebound was I reached out and discovered my online mommy community. And this was a huge help, especially when I was not uh, leaving the house much and not really connecting with people. You know, my husband had gone back to work and most of my friends either had children that were older or they had gone back to work. I talk about this a lot. Um, and so I realized that I really needed help um, in that first year. And, you know, connecting with others was going to be a big part of that. And I realized that if I wanted a village, because I did not have any family in town for the first year, um, I realized if I wanted a village, I was going to have to go out and create one. And so I really focused on that. Um, and this is where I started seeking out support systems and baby classes that were out there. And you'll be surprised a lot of baby classes uh, that are offered can oftentimes be free, which is just a bonus. Um, and the third phase that I went through was months six through 12. Um, to be honest, I gave myself a year to, you know, I won't say bounce back, but um, get into, you know, better health, overall health. Um, and so this phase, my focus was primarily on finding the new me um, and also finding my new style. So, you know, transitioning from being a careerist to a stay-at-home mom, um, you know, several things changed. My priorities changed, my daily schedule changed, and let's be honest, my body changed. And that's okay. You know, while it happened for a beautiful reason, and I feel good about that, um, I found myself trying to figure out this new me. And, um, 
this was one of the things that I, I focused on and I look forward to going into it more with you. So I uh, just hope everyone's having a good day. Hope everybody's hanging in there. Hope everyone's getting either used to your new baby routine or um, maybe your child's a little bit older and you're seeking out more support systems. I'm looking forward to bringing more tips and ideas for you soon. All right, until next time, bye.